My name is Kemi Akintewe. I'm at the Chemical and Biomedical Engineering Department. In our lab, we work on smart polymers. Smart polymers are applicable in different applications, such as tissue engineering, microfluidic devices, sensors, or actuators. In my particular research, I work with polyniperm, which is polyisopropylacrylamide, and I'm working on creating different geometric surfaces and seeing how cells adhere on the surfaces. My name is Andrea Sanchez and I'm a PhD student at the Civil and Environmental Engineering Department here at USF. Today I'm presenting the chloride corrosion threshold dependence on potential in reinforced mortar. The chloride corrosion threshold is an important parameter for the prediction of durability of concrete structures exposed to marine environments. Usually this value is used as a fixed value, but previous work has shown that it depends on the concrete properties the steel bar surface, and the dependence of the potential. With my work, I confirm that this is true. If this is implemented, less money can be spent in the construction and in the maintenance of these structures. An important part of transportation safety is the texture of a pavement. The more texture a pavement has, the more likely the water is to run off of the roadway during a heavy rainstorm, and also the shorter the stopping distance is for cars. There are many different pieces of equipment to test this, uh, most of which are very expensive. However, there is an equipment that came out in the 70s called the outflow meter, and I am currently redesigning the equation for it to make it more accurate and to incorporate the slope and whether the pavement is an asphalt or concrete. My name is Marbelli Davila. I am a PhD candidate at the Department of Industrial and Management Systems Engineering. Our research focuses on developing a novel methodology to planning and scheduling operating rooms under uncertainty. Operating rooms has been identified at the hospitals and genes. It accounts for over 40% of hospitals' total expenses. We are trying to use a surgical database from a local hospital to predict and build accurate and reliable OR schedules. My name is Sandy Pettit. I'm a PhD student in the Department of Chemical and Biomedical Engineering at USF. Currently, my research is in photocatalysis. Commercially, this can be used in aquaculture systems to reduce freshwater requirements. Increased yield in aquaculture is a viable, sustainable alternative to fishing of our currently strained marine ecosystems.